<laughs> Look at it. Do you see it? You see it? Do you see it? You guys, it's so nice, nice in the in garage here. right now. Look, we're not sweating. There's no, do you hear the fan blowing? We don't have any fans on except for this. Listen. Nope. It's can't so hear it. nice. It's so quiet. Um, and then I thought, is it really that nice in here or is it just nice outside this morning? And we went outside and I was like, oh, nope, it's humid. It was, yeah, it's it was humid. bad It's outside. getting warm. So the mini split is done. Hi, mini split is almost done. The mini split is up and running. We have a mess to clean up. We, uh, we're going to go over some things today. Hi, everybody. We're Happy Heart <laughs> Treasures. I'm Steve. I'm Donna. We're full-time resellers in Lincoln, Nebraska. Rehomers of stuff. And we have just a fun little video today. We're going to talk about... We hit a milestone that we've been yes, talking we're about. We have a drawing, you guys. Yeah, we hit 2,000 subscribers. Thank you to everybody that is subscribed. If you're watching this and you're not subscribed, go ahead and hit the subscribe button. It doesn't cost you anything and it really helps our channel out a lot. Also, if you like these videos and these kind of videos, hit the like button. You know, we and like And the that. notification bell. And comment. All those things. We, yeah. pre -appreci we appreciate all of it. So we are going to have a drawing. We will talk about that after a bit. Um, we're going to show you kind of where we're at with all this. Our basement is a mess because we had to I haven't even been down there. get to the electrical panel and stuff. So I have to put that back together. But then we're going to show you. We got like, I don't know, 10, 12 things to ship. We're going to show you those. There are some fun things. But first, we just wanted to show you our garage is quiet and cool and it's so awesome. So here's our unit. It's a Mr. Cool. There's the filter. Isn't it beautiful? Beautiful. It's on auto. It's on Wi-Fi. We can run it from the phone, from the remote control, from lots of things. First we were gonna all, we were gonna clean up the garage before we filmed. No, but look at they didn't see this part, you guys. Yeah. See how it ended up? Yeah. This area is empty. Yes. We took and one that's van load to the storage. Stacked, and this is neatly arranged with labels. So yep. we know what to show you. Yeah, we were going to clean up the garage. Sorry, I'll turn around in the light. We were going to clean up the garage and then film like, you know, everything's nice and neat, but we didn't because you know what? This is the morning after. It was a long day yesterday doing this. Show them your mess. With Larry. Um, I, I want to say doing this with Larry, but I will actually say it was a long day of Larry doing this. Supporting Larry. With me supporting him <laughs> being his gopher. So anyway uh yeah we got a mess we got things to sort between tools between the both of us we got trash to throw away we got cardboard boxes we got all kinds of things let's go look at the yard all right i did get it mowed and we also look at the flower bed i got it knocked down okay before we look at this like i said this is a do-it-yourself project and it's not done out here we need to do some tidying up out here so Save your judgmental comments, all you oh. judgmental people, Stop. for somebody else because we're not done out here. Isn't it all pretty? Right, there it is. <laughs> there it is. Isn't it beautiful? <laughs> now, it's not done. We're going to do some uh, hiding some stuff. We're going to kind of have these up in the air a little bit, whatever. But yeah, I'm gonna we got put some my things to finish. Rocks. This was an More overgrown, yeah, it overgrown was a mess. mess. This is like the garden that Donna misses because this is an area of the house it's, that we don't get to. It's the garden nobody loves very much. Yeah, this we're never out in this section of the house. So I'm going to encourage this ground cover to grow under it and then keep the taller things away from it. Yeah. So. So there it is. Yay! Isn't that beautiful? You're beautiful. Yeah, you're beautiful too. <laughs> All right, we're going to head downstairs now. We're going to pull and pick orders or whatever you call it. And then we're going to tell you what to do to try to win our 2,000 subscriber giveaway. So first off, come and see the clothes room. Oh, <laughs> you wonder what happened to all that stuff in the garage? There was a lot of totes and boxes that were clothes. And so they came down here and we do have one room that's a mess. Before we get in there, look at this. We had to get back in there, so I actually did clean, vacuum. Oh, and look, look, look. All that. There's Vermont colored in right there. Thank you, Vermont. Now we need your friend New Hampshire and Alaska. Yep. We do have a package that has been to New Hampshire. I'll explain that in a little bit, but we don't get to color that in. 
We should, because it went there. No. Nope. <laughs> yeah, this is, uh, it's bad. Uh, look at all of this came in from the garage. Yeah, and not only that. And so we've got some clothes to work, you guys. You may think, oh, they're hoarders. No, we're not. No, we're not hoarders. We're We've just been workers. really blessed with a lot of inventory. Yeah, so there's and, some more clothes. And then this was a big mess. I brought the fireboxes in here, like, kind of had to move stuff out of this room well, some of your yesterday. Boxes so are everything there. is nice and neat out here. Yeah. And now we can start messing it up again. Yeah. All right, cool. Let's pull some orders and then we'll talk about the package that is visiting New Hampshire or visited New Hampshire. <laughs> so and then we'll talk about our giveaway. So Ooh. let's get into this. All right, first thing we have is a shirt. Panhandle brand, button Look at down, the pearl snaps, button. pearl snaps. Or snaps, I mean. Yep, $10 right there. Okay. And that. Where's it going? And that is going to California. Okay. I always forget about that part. Box 27, Donna. Let's go 27. there. 27. I can't find it. It's so clean. I know, right? <laughs> In here from an air park private pick clean out type thing, there is uh, number 913. It's a butter dish. No, it's a celery cracker dish. Oh, here it is. It's a something dish. It's a dish. Yeah, oh right my there. goodness, you boys, look at these little shoes. <laughs> no Nike, somebody needs them for their baby. <laughs> oh my goodness. All right, open that up. Sorry, guys. Right. This is a vintage Indiana glass amber carnival basket weave celery cracker bread dish. Ooh, that's pretty. And that sold for Jeepers, I'm 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 struggling today. That sold for eleven dollars and eighty nine cents, and it is going to Maryland. Oh, okay. uh, next up, if you watched the last video, you saw me get an offer for two dollars and fifty cents, and I asked, "What would you do?" I didn't wasn't in the mood. I wasn't in the mood to play the game, so I just declined it. And what do you know? That game sold right here. NBA Jam, that game sold for full price of $13.99. I sure am glad I didn't take the $2.50, oh, huh? Oh, man. And, yeah, it actually sold to a drop shipper because um, they asked for no... no. Uh, so we assume it was a drop shipper. Well, it's, it's a drop shipper, and I don't care. Drop shippers don't bother me. Yeah, you're not supposed to drop ship, I guess. They don't bother me because when they buy stuff, usually it's like this, and they pay full price, and they just want it to get delivered to the person. So $13.99, and... Please do not include any invoice inside the parcel. Um, so maybe it's a dropshipper, maybe it's not. Going where? Going to Texas. Texas. All right, next up, box 107. Oh. Back in here. Oh, it's probably buried a little bit. It's, okay. it's right here on the end. Sweet. You're so lucky. I am lucky. <laughs> uh, here we're going to have some vintage thermo temp raffia wear cups right there oh, yeah. i remember these you just take one of them out there's three total of them two well there was three now there's two two different colors <laughs> there's this and then there's a tan. two teals and then like a tan or brown and they sold for 24 dollars 99 cents and they are going to ohio and she got those at garage sale for a dollar fifty, fifty cents a piece. All right, going to box forty-four now. Forty-four. All right, here we're looking for a box. It's a set of four stoneware salad dressing nutcracker. Oh, nutcracker. Nutcracker plates. All right, right there, and they sold for twenty-nine ninety-nine, and they are going to Illinois. Okay, Donna, in box LL, this might be tough to get to too. This is going to be something you got. We got one of us got it at garage sale for a dollar. Heavy. You're looking for an Instapot right there on top, right there. Instapot uh, rings, replacement rings. Paid one dollar to garage sale, sold for eleven dollars and seventy nine cents, and going to Wisconsin. You just added two of them in there. Yes. All right. Next up was box LK, and there's two things in here. Uh, number one 
is a... Bagalini bag, no. No, not a Bagalini bag. Mary's Angels. That's one of them right there. Mary's Angels. Uh, it's a lot of 16 just, Hallmark Mary's Angels. Just going to show you one because yeah. they're all wrapped. And there's one of Mary's Angels right there. And on the bottom is her signature. Yeah. So sold. they're all with this little style. Yeah, sold for $30 and going to Indiana. You can ship in this plastic coat if you want to. Okay, I probably will. All right, next up is a Simply Safe a key mm -hmm. fob. It's a little bitty box. This? Uh, nope. A little long box. That? No. Nope. Small. Smaller. Oh, it's teeny tiny. Yeah, it's a key fob, like for your keychain. And that is a Simply Safe key fob remote, $14.99. Got it in a lot of things that I got for $12, and that is going to Minnesota. Okay. That's it for that box. Four more things to go out. Uh, before we do that, I want to tell you this story about our package that is traveling on a great grand adventure. So last night I got a phone call. <laughs> no, I got a <laughs> message on eBay from somebody in Rolla, Missouri which is where our kid went to college. So that's awesome. And they said, hey, I just want to let you know this situation. Our package got to Kansas City. Rolla, Missouri is about two and a half, three hours from Kansas City. And they said it got to Kansas City fine. Then when it left, it seems to be on some kind of weird adventure. And I just want to tell you where all it's going. So it left here, Lincoln. Went to Omaha, went to Kansas City. It departed Kansas City, and it next showed up in... Boston, Massachusetts. Let's follow okay. this. Let's follow this. Okay. So Left Boston, Nebraska. Went to Kansas City. Down in here. Right there. Right there, okay. And then went up to Boston, Massachusetts. Okay. You gotta figure out where that is. <laughs> but I don't know where Boston right there. is. Well, that's fine. Anyway, this state. And then after that, it went to Nashaw, New Hampshire, the Ooh. state we need. It went to New Hampshire. It left New Hampshire, and then it went to, uh, looks like Middlesex, Essex, Ma Massachusetts? No, 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 M-A. Yeah, Massachusetts, so back to Massachusetts. And then after that, it went to Connecticut. So down to Connecticut, and then that's the last I saw. <laughs> and so it's supposed to go where? <laughs> supposed to go right in the middle of Missouri, right <laughs> oh, there. Rolla. Yeah. Oh, man. Yeah, so... So I messaged the lady back, and I'm like, wow, that little package is on a grand adventure. I sure hope it finds its way to you. So we're going to keep an eye on that, and hopefully it makes it to them. That was the little ornaments. So unfortunately, we have a package that went to Connecticut, or New, New Hampshire, but we still can't count that New as Hampshire. a sale in New Hampshire. Yeah. Something back here sold. Does anyone want to guess? Do you think it's the green alien pig? How about the new blue kitty? Nope. Right here. Cabbage Patch Snack Time Kid Feeding Fun Rocker Seat. Right there. That sold. And that sold for $30 plus shipping. We paid seven at an estate sale for this. And it is going to Alabama. We later cleaned out that estate sale. Did we? Mm -hmm. Alabama. There you go. Okay. Uh, I got one more that I picked. I'll go grab that since she has the camera. This was a fun sale to see come through last night. I was like, oh my gosh, awesome. I thought it would sell sooner, but uh, it's okay. This is, look at this beautiful piece of history. Look at that. Brand new, still in the package, still in the cardboard, saucepans. Look Six, at the price tag. 69 cents for that right there. Can you see it? Since 1871 Colombian, they're enamelware, but they're all brand new. I paid $20 for these at a at an estate sale. In Crete. In Crete, yep. We had Ink Picker with us that day. There's uh, the price. That's something. Oh, made in the USA. Made in the USA. Um, so yeah, I, we had Ink Picker, we went to Crete to an estate sale, I paid $20, and it sold for $119.99, and it is going to Wyoming. Doesn't even have to ship very far. You paid $20? Yep. $20, I just thought, that's brand new and that's old, it's got to be worth something. So, made $100 after fees and everything, whatever, <laughs> it doesn't matter. All right, we got two more things, and uh, we're going to have Donna do them both. 
First up, she looks confused. First up is the uh, coat that's hanging on the door. Oh yeah. We've had lots and lots of people look at it. Yeah. Sent lots of offers. And then it sold for full price, didn't it? Uh, it sold for $40. I don't know what full price was, but I'll go back a little bit so the lights be in front of it. There you go. So this coat, lots of people looked at it and it sold for $40 and it is going to Washington. I don't know why you didn't just keep that, Donna. Clashes with my hire. Oh, well, there you go. <laughs> All right, one last thing, and this is from the very first clean out we ever did. We call it Malcolm, and oh. it was very, very hard and very, very expensive for us to do because we did it for free. And we had like seven trips. And we had a lot of help that we and paid. it was out of town. Yeah, but uh, we learned a lot that day. Yeah. And we're going to box 86. Cut. In here, you're looking for a Delta. Was it Delta? United. United Airlines duffel bag. Vintage United Airlines duffel bag. Right there, there was a lot of stuff from United Airlines. United Airlines stuff. So we have some more in the store still. Yep. Um, because they both worked for United. Yep. So that sold for $15 and it is going to Ohio. It's a duffel bag. That's it. That's it for now. That's everything we got to ship. Should we talk giveaway? <gasps> yes, let's do it. <laughs> All right. We can stand here now, and now we have a spot right there. We're going to have to find something we else put for that. Something in there. For that shelf. All right. We're going to give away a $50 eBay gift card. And you don't have to spend it in our store. It's nice if you do, but you don't have to. You yes. can send it anywhere on I, ebay i have to say this because the last time we gave away a gift card somebody from canada won it oh, and they can't to. couldn't use it so it's an american so, dollar. so here's the thing we don't if you don't live in the united states you can still win we have no issue with that but here's the stipulations you have to have either paypal or venmo and then we would send you 50 us dollars however it translates yeah. you get what you get you don't throw a fit is what we used to tell our kids if you're overseas so if you're not in the country you get 50 us dollars if you have paypal or venmo if you don't have either one please don't enter and because it would just complicate things yes. but that's but that's the rules of the game if you win and you're in the united states well, wherever you are, we'll send you your winnings with a sticker. So if you're in the United States, we'll send your card with a sticker. Yep, absolutely. Of course we will. Um, so what are we going to do, Donna, in the comments? Uh, um, hashtag two. That's do boring. Hash hashtag. We were going to do that, but I thought this might be kind of boring. So I told Donna if she wanted to do something more fun. Okay, we had a team meeting. <laughs> and we, <laughs> we decided what we're going to do here for the giveaway so in order to enter for the giveaway, what do you have to put in the comments? Hashtag happy for Happy Heart there you Treasures. Go. So just hashtag happy. Yeah, where we will hope to make you happy because y'all make us happy. Yeah. So hashtag happy in the comments. And then on a, we will leave this open. Okay, everybody, this is future, future me and future Donna. Same day, later in the day. The video I wanted to get out today, it is, what day is it? Wednesday? Yeah, I don't know. But it ain't going to be out until tomorrow, Thursday. We worked a long time to finish up the unit, and then we had tons of running around. We drove all yeah. around the town. Yes. So we're and going to... to the puppy dogs. We're going to extend the deadline to sign up. Hashtag happy. Yes. Until we're going to draw late Saturday night, like the end of the day of Saturday. Yeah, after supper. And then we plan to put a video out Sunday... And we'll announce who won then. So you yes. have until the end of our day, Saturday night, no specific time, no. to put hashtag happy. Um, let's in the it, comments. In the comments. Something yeah. in a comment. Hashtag happy. Yeah. Here's, still haven't cleaned this up. It's been uh, quite a day. Quite a day. Larry came back. We finished up. Let's go take a look at the finished product out here. Hi, Bobby. I'm going to take the dogs for a walk because... It's so nice out and they want to walk, so. But on the way out, let's do this. There is the finished product, all nice and neat, nice and clean. And it is amazing every time we walk through the garage, walk in the garage, it's the same temperature. It's so quiet. We don't have big fans running. We're really excited. And this weekend is 100 degrees. 
several days. So it's going to be a great test and we're really looking forward to it. So we're going to take the dogs for a walk back to the regular show. Back to the regular video. Until we will do the drawing. The Today next is video. Wednesday. Mm -hmm. uh, I tell you what, Friday at noon. So oh. Friday, July 12th okay. at noon, we're going to, whatever we're doing, we're going to do the drawing. And whether we're filming right then or not, that's when we're going to close it and do the drawing. And it'll be on the next video that should Yay. come out either Friday or Saturday. Yes. All right, there you go. Hashtag happy. You can win yourself a $50 eBay gift card. Thank you all for watching. Yes. We appreciate all of you. Seriously. We couldn't have made it without you. Yep. Yep. So that's it. We got lots of things to do. We got uh, things to clean up in the garage. We got to get to back to work. Yeah. Got to get to shipping. All kinds of stuff to do. So thanks everybody for watching. She's Donna. He's Steve. <laughs> we are Happy Art Treasures. We'll see you on the next one. Bye.